Are you ready? Okay. Here's the thing. Um, put down all the pieces. They're taped down. You might want to put more and one more pieces of tape if you think it's going to come up. The main thing is you hold it down as you go around it. And we're going to make a negative picture. Um, I'm going to pick colors that are kind of close to each other on the color wheel. When I put them next to each other, else I end up with browns. So, and when you're changing colors, you need to make sure that you change your brush. Um, I think uh, I'm going to start out with this pink and go around the top. And I'm going to make it so that it's bigger and closer together in some spots. So it's like, notice that's not a lot of space, but that's a big space. So I'm going around here. Now, but keeping it down is very important because if you get underneath it, you will lose your definition of what you're making. Well, I know that this color will mix with this other one, so I can change the color there. So now, I've used the same brush twice because those two colors were right next to each other in the color wheel and they were analogous. Just like we would use analogous colors to make it. Okay. Now, the whole thing doesn't have to be done. Most of it should. Now, I'm gonna be careful because if these two colors touch, it's going to turn brown. And that's not totally bad, except for maybe it will not be what I want. Now notice, I went and did more of it out here, okay? I'd rather you not do the whole thing because I think it'll be too much. Okay. Make sure that you get some. Now, I have some yellow. The yellow won't show up a lot. Get a new brush. You realize that when these two touch to each other, it's gonna make this a light, uh, you know, a lighter form of yellow, uh, uh, orange. I'm gonna go and get some of this now. Now, if for some reason you get one that is a wet brush, wipe it off on a paper towel. Get a paper towel, wipe it off before you start because of problem. Now, I can get some more of this pink and I can't do it. Now, I really don't know what this is going to look like. I think it's going to look really good. You got to be careful about how you pick it up. If you pick it up and you get your fingers underneath it with stuff all over it, it's going to look terrible, which is one reason why I don't want you to put too much tape on it so it'll come up easy. If I carefully peel it up, and be careful not to rip the paper. Now, the bunny rabbit showed. Grass show. You see, I ripped it a little bit. You gotta be careful when you pull this stuff up because easily you get a big lip going across your face. So maybe it was too light a color over here. Maybe I should have kept with more darker colors. Mm -hmm. It's not impossible to go back in afterwards if you're careful and redefine stuff, maybe. I mean, that's what she does. She goes back in and paints. 
outlines and all sorts of things. You gotta be careful or she'll lose everything. Here you go.